first of all thanks for being here in my youtube channel so here in this mistake series video we will be seeing some of the mistakes that usually every student used to do at the beginning of learning aptitude for the competitive exams or even i have seen some students are making these kinds of mistakes in the competitive exam itself so these kinds of mistakes usually happen only because of the time pressure in their exams because student have to solve the question within 20 seconds or within 30 seconds so because of the time pressure i have seen many students or usually they used to do these kinds of silly mistakes on their exams that is especially on the mathematics so in order to avoid those kinds of mistake so this mistake series video will definitely help you to avoid such a mistakes in the upcoming competitive exams so don't forget to watch all the complete mistake series video so that it will be very very helpful if you are preparing for the competitive exams so and one more important thing so many students those who are asking all my videos all my feel free to learn videos in offline either it can be a pen drive mode or it can be sd card mode where you can get the pen drive and you can able to watch all my videos what i posted on my channel feel free to learn in offline so get the pen drive or get the sd card start learning for the upcoming competitive exams if you want any details how to purchase it whatsapp us so our team will contact you soon so thank you so much and now let me move on to the mistake series videos so friends here is the video number three that is on mistake series on the topic simplification so just look at the question 9 division 3 multiplication 4 division 6 is equal to question mark so one of the easy simplification question right we have to simplify and we need to say the answer but the most common mistake here that every student used to do at the beginning time here is instead of dividing the number first they multiply these two numbers 4 into 3 first they do this i have seen many students are making this mistake 9 division 12 division 6 is equal to question mark and then they try to solve this the remaining part of the question is this right way to solve the question no it's exactly wrong you should not solve like that you know right if you are going to solve a mathematical operation question there is a basic thing that is called the board mass right so never forget this board mass rule so first you have to solve the things which are the numbers or whatever be inside the brackets and second is off third will be division fourth will be multiplication addition and subtraction so only after this division part right only after this division part we have multiplication so first you have to divide and then only you have to multiply so now according to the question what is the question here just see the question so 9 division 3 right so 9 division 3 sorry so 9 division 3 into 4 division 6 so first you have division here understood here also you have division so first divide the numbers and then multiply the numbers got it so first divide so 9 division 3 multiplication 4 division 6 is equal to question mark so now try to cancel it i think we can cancel it on three table which is three times so cancel it on three table two times so two so question mark is equals to two so answer for this question where the question mark is equal to two so friends understood or not right so don't make this mistake again and again in the exams remember that the board mass rule are important most probably by just seeing the question the computer students used to do this they just multiply 4 into 3 12 and then start solving the question they used to do this so don't do that it's wrong way always whenever you are going to solve a question that is based on uh, equations or mathematical operations so first remember the board mass rule so there is an another example question here right so 24 division 8 minus 6 division 2 equal to question mark so first thing what you should not do the main thing that you should not do here is i have seen most students will subtract these two numbers 8 minus 6 they will write like this division 2 division 2 is equal to question mark and then they divide these two numbers so 24 division 1 so our question mark is equal to 24 don't do this it's a wrong way to solve the question right so do not divide like this it's wrong actually so first according to the board mass rule before subtraction you have to divide the numbers that is 24 division 8 minus of 6 division 2 is equal to question mark right so now 8 3 is at 24 so 3 here so cancel it 3 times 3 here is equal to question mark so question mark is equals to 0 
so which will be the answer for this example question so so in this video number three what we have learned is the bodmos rule that is multiplication and division so there are many methods i have seen students usually say you can multiply first and then you can divide some question you will get the answer in some question you have to divide first and then you have to multiply so don't get confused right so wherever you see this division and multiplication always divide the number first and then go with multiplication or if you want to add or if you want to subtract whatever be always follow the bodmash rule so first divide and then add or subtract based on the question so thank you so much for watching this video so uh, let me move on to the next next uh, video series mistake series and don't forget to take a note on all these mistakes separately so one day or two day before going for an exam when you revise it it will be definitely helpful for your competitive exams so thank you so much friends for watching this video bye so friends and one more important thing in my feel free to learn platform we are providing one course that is how to make a videos education videos on a youtube platform so we will teach you all the techniques because i have seen many students who are keep on asking me i want to share the knowledge to the other students how i can make a videos proper education videos on a youtube platform so this is a green screen video you can able to see the background is completely green screen i am using a software a tab and a pen so i will teach you all the steps right how to make a proper education videos and how to start your youtube channel where you should invest money and where should not invest your money and wasting your money is not needed so if you if you have a passion of teaching or if you like you want to share your knowledge to the other students by teaching and youtube or various platform we will definitely help you how to make a proper education videos it will be a complete paid course i will told you already i have told you why it is paid everything so in case if you have any details whatsapp us we will we will help you to join in the private class and we will make you and we will help you to make an education videos on your own so thank you so much friends for watching this video bye